come with me to record my audiobook. So I'm at a professional sound studio in Philadelphia where the magic is happening. I have an engineer. His name is Jeff, and he's married to a doula, so he's not scandalized by talking about vaginas and sex. I also have a director, Lisa, who's patching in remotely through my headphones. So as I'm reading, she and Jeff are giving me feedback on how things sound. They may have me do a take again because they picked up noise from my pants moving or the way I phrase something was a little bit weird. I've also never been so aware of when I breathe because if you gasp in the middle of a sentence, it'll get picked up by the microphone. And also how moisturized my mouth is because if your mouth gets dry, it sounds strange in the mic. So I drink a lot of tea as I'm recording. So every place where I have to redo a take, Jeff is making a note so that the editing team can put it together flawlessly and make it sound like I did it all in one take. You'll notice that every surface, including the chair, is covered in material like fabric, and that's to absorb echoes which affect the recording quality. You'll also notice we're using an iPad and not a paper manuscript to read, and that's because turning pages is too loud. It gets picked up by the microphone. I hope you've enjoyed this behind-the-scenes look. I cannot wait for you to read and listen to It's Not His